one of the most iconic photos of the 20th century, recreated with a twist. A sailor and his husband posed for their own version of the kissing sailor at a homecoming in Florida. Then your side's Kayla Gaskin spoke with the couple. So, Kayla, the Woodingtons are based in Florida, but they have strong ties to Hampton Roads. So, Brian Woodington grew up in Suffolk, and then he attended Old Dominion University. He then went to Florida, where the Navy sent him, and he met his husband, Ken. And here is the photo everyone is talking about. It's a feeling military spouses know all too well. It was, it was really rough, and it was hard. The painful separation of a first deployment together. The first couple months, I was crying myself to sleep. Brian Woodington spent seven months on the USS The Sullivans. On board there was a print of the iconic kissing sailor from VJ Day. I told him I wanted to recreate that picture because I thought it was gorgeous. It was beautiful. When Brian returned home December 21st, he was in his winter blues, and Ken wore all white. And he ran to me and he grabbed me and he put his arms around me. It was like a bear hug. I couldn't get him off me. I couldn't pry him off. He was crying and he was so happy. The photo has since gone viral, even making international news. Not all the reaction is positive. But Ken and Brian say the good outweighs the bad. I'm happy that people get to see the kind of love that we have for each other and just showing two people who are in love. And with a hint of serendipity, the sailor who claims it's him in the original photo, George Mendoza, was on leave from the first USS The Sullivans during the iconic kiss. The couple says they never expected the photo to go viral like it has. And in light of the backlash, some, in some corners of the Internet, the Woodingtons say the Navy has been nothing but positive and supportive. I'm Kayla Gaskins, Sound on your side.